Hills Light every morning. Well, here locally, since the pandemic started, school districts have put safety protocols in place to protect their teachers and students. Local 23's Talisa Hampton has the details on how schools are taking their safety precautions outside of the classroom. Good morning, Talisa. Good morning. Safety measures from in person learning at schools are already underway, but that doesn't mean that's where the safety measures end. A school official tells me it starts on buses. Mission CISD's Craig Verley says the school bus is where many students make contact before the school begins. The district knew from day one it was important to make sure they have all safety measures in place because of the pandemic. Hand sanitizer right at the door of the bus so that the kids can uh, take advantage of that if they want as they're getting on or off the bus. While on the bus, they're all distanced. The windows uh, are enough of them are lowered at least enough to allow for fresh air ventilation. Verley says all decision making when it comes to the health and safety of students and staff is based on what's happening locally in terms of COVID-19 community spread. In the next half hour, what could be important to a lot of parents when it comes to protocols on school buses? Putting local first, I'm Talisa Hampton.